What do you wish? I'm the clan's craftsmaster. It's my responsibility to learn what I can of the ancient elven arts of shaping wood and ore. In truth, we Dalish know little of the art compared to what we once did. And even what we know has taken us many lifetimes to achieve. There is wood that, if treated properly, is as hard as steel but far lighter. It grows only in this forest, Ironbark. The Keeper has forbidden us from entering the forest to collect the wood. This means I cannot make our finest crafts for years to come. I would be hesitant to ask it of you, but if you should come across Ironbark, I suppose there would be no harm in gathering some. It is blue and very distinctive. You can only harvest the bark which has fallen off the tree from age. Now, if you find some, bring it to me, and I will craft it for you. I excel in making blades from the iron bark, or, or perhaps a breastplate, provided there's enough wood, that is. And I did not ask for a promise. I only ask that you consider the task should you come across the bark in the forest. Darth Shiro, may the Creators visit fortune upon you. There are places... Who comes? Oh, I beg your pardon, stranger. I was so busy attending to the Hala, I did not hear your approach. My name is Alora. I am the Master Herder in charge of caring for the Hala. Not as exciting as being a Grey Warden, but the Hala are vital to us. They are the noble beasts that pull our Aravel. What humans call landships. They are our companions, and our guides. We ride the Hala, but never with reins or a saddle. It is the Hala who decide where to lead us, and our privilege that they take our Aravel with them. In return, it's the herder's job to speak to the Hala and care for their needs. It's a bond of friendship, and not servitude. I fear she may have been bitten during the werewolf attack. I have tried speaking with her, but she is too agitated for me to understand. The curse would not affect her as it would us, but it would still be lethal, and it may prove contagious to the other Hala as well. I can find no wound on her, but if she's truly ill, then... then I will have to put her out of her misery, for her sake as well as that of the others. I don't know. Do you have any skills that might help her? If you do, I would be grateful. It. She's calming down. That's it, love. Be calm. Tell me what troubles you. Ah, I see. It is her life mate who is sick, not her. He was bitten on the leg during the attack, and she fears greatly for him. I did not realize another Hala was injured. This will allow me to prevent the sickness from spreading to the entire herd. Masiranus, thank you. You have done my clan a great boon this day. I will always be grateful for your help. <laughs>